Tortuga offers two travel pack options, the Travel Backpack Pro and the Travel Backpack Lite. Now, both travel packs are the exact same dimensions and have 40 liters of packing capacity. But the Lite weighs one pound less than the Pro, and it's also $100 cheaper. But why? What's missing? And are these missing features going to be complete deal breakers for travelers? We're going to reveal the seven major differences that set these bags apart, starting with the size and fit. This is what both backpacks look like on someone who is five foot six. You can see that they're both the same size. But difference number one is the way each backpack fits. You see, the Tortuga Backpack Pro has four adjustment points. The adjustable back panel to match your torso length, the shoulder straps and lift loaders, the adjustable chest strap, and the adjustable hip belt. Now, the adjustable back panel is a huge deal because you can really customize the fit based on your height. Once you dial in all of the adjustment points, you get a custom fit backpack that's very comfortable under heavy loads. The Tortuga Backpack Lite, however, has a fixed back pedal that is not adjustable. So you only get three adjustment points on the Lite versus four for the Pro. Difference number two. In order to reduce the weight, Tortuga also uses less padding on the Lite. So there is less cushioning overall. Now some opinions. The shoulder straps feel exactly the same. They are both very comfortable. But after wearing both bags for a while, I actually prefer the thinner back panel on the light. It just has a little bit more flex. The back panel on the Pro feels a lot stiffer. And with the waist belt, you can visibly see how much smaller it is on the light. It's also missing the pockets. The waist belt on the Pro feels like pillows when you wear it. It is very, very comfortable. Whereas the waist belt on the light is still comfortable, but nothing groundbreaking. Speaking of groundbreaking, Difference number three is actually an upgrade for the light. These straps can all be tucked away. There are also little pockets that allow you to tuck away the hip belt. This is a really big deal because now you have a nice way to carry the bag by the side handle without those annoying dangling straps. And this feature is completely missing on the Travel Backpack Pro. Now this next difference is a major one. In order to make the light both cheaper and lighter, there is way less organization in the light. Although both packs have the same top pocket with a key leash, that's the only pocket that has stayed the same. Look at the front pockets. The one on the light is a lot smaller. And we're talking about the difference between being able to pack a hoodie or jacket and being able to pack a hat. They're very different sized pockets. And while the Pro has a water bottle pocket on each side of the pack, the light only has one pocket made out of mesh. But here's a surprise. The mesh side pocket can actually fit larger bottles. You can see it fits a large 40 ounce bottle. The side pockets on the Pro don't stretch far enough to fit those larger bottles. Now this next difference might be a deal breaker for some people. The Tortuga Travel Backpack Lite is missing the large front organizer compartment. The Pro has this massive front compartment with tons of pockets for organization. And it even has a soft line pocket for a small tablet like an iPad mini or Kindle. When traveling, this front compartment is very useful. This is where all those small items go for quick access. And it's even roomy enough to fit larger pouches. It's a very big space. And this compartment is completely missing on the light. Difference number five are the interesting changes made to the packing compartment. Both backpacks have the same 40 liter capacity, so you can fit about the same amount of clothes. But while the Tortuga Pro has a single mesh pocket on the left side, the Lite has two smaller mesh pockets. Which is better really comes down to packing preference. The single mesh pocket on the Pro is better for bigger items like shirts and jackets while the smaller pockets on the light are better for stuff like socks and other small pieces of clothing. Now, there is one last compartment on both bags, which leads us to difference number six, the laptop storage. Now check this out. The Pro has an entire tech compartment with a 16 inch laptop sleeve, a second tablet sleeve, and it even includes a mesh pocket for accessories. The backpack light is just a 16 inch laptop sleeve. That's it. That's the whole thing. The good news is that both compartments have a very generous false bottom to protect those laptops from bumps and drops. 
so you'll be fine with either bag. And now for the final difference, and maybe even the most important, the water resistance. Now, the Tortuga Pro uses a material called Shell 200. It's a sailcloth material that is waterproof, very tough, and rip resistant. The zippers are also YKK water resistant zippers. When you pair these two materials together, you get a very water resistant backpack that will do really well in the rain. The Tortuga Lite, however, uses Cordura Ballistic Nylon with a water repellent finish. This fabric is heavy duty with some great tear and puncture resistance, but it's not waterproof. And we have YKK fabric zippers instead of those coated water resistant zippers. So to compare the water resistance, honestly, the light is nothing special. It's on par with the water resistance you'll see on other travel packs at this price point, while the Pro will be an absolute beast in bad weather. So how do you choose between these two backpacks? That can be tough because there are pros and cons to both bags. But to make it simple, if you want the most waterproof protection, the ability to really customize your fit, and value organization of smaller items, then go with the Tortuga Travel Backpack Pro. But if you want to be able to tuck away those dangling straps, maybe you don't carry a lot of tech when you travel, and would like a lighter weight backpack overall, then the Tortuga Lite is going to be your best bet. Hey, hope this comparison helped. Give the video a like if it did. And as always, thank you so much for watching.